current QNH on first contact with Heathrow. Heathrow Information Delta. Time 1320 Zulu. Automatic. Arrival runway 27 right departure runway 27 left. Transition level flight level 75. Surface winds to 10 degrees 10 knots. Varying between 180 and 250 degrees, visibility 10 kilometers, or more. Few at 2,900 feet. Scattered 3,400 feet, temperature plus 18, dew point plus 12, QNH 1010. Acknowledge receipt of information delta. And report aircraft type and current QNH on first contact with Heathrow. Heathrow Information Delta. Time 1320 Zulu. Automatic. Arrival runway 27 right departure runway 27 left. Transition level flight level 75. Surface winds to 10 degrees 10 knots. Varying between 180 and 250 degrees. Visibility 10 kilometers or more. Few at 2,900 feet. Scattered 3,400 feet, temperature plus 18, dew point plus 12, QNH 1010. Acknowledge receipt of information delta. And report aircraft type and current QNH on first contact with Heathrow. Heathrow information delta. Time 1320 Zulu. Automatic. Arrival runway 27 right departure runway 27 left transition level flight level 75 surface winds to 10 degrees 10 knots varying between 180 and 250 degrees visibility 10 kilometers or more few at 2900 uh, 134125 I'm
Or search those versions closed, Unicom contact contact uh one three four that's more one two five away. London Radio, good afternoon, EC, A2 and NFO with you, crossing 2,400 feet. EZ8294, London, hello, climb flight level 180. Flight level 180, EC, A2 and NFO. B line 7 Alpha, tail fly heading 250, descent flight level 80, high speed approved. Uh, heading 250, down to flight level 80, high speed approved, uh, B line 7 Alpha Hotel. EZ 471, one to Unicom, bye. Monitor Unicom, bye bye, thank you. Safe Town, Chicago, 4545, four, verified climbing, flight level 180. The restrictions are always cancelled unless I say climb by sit. Copy that, uh, climbing to 180 for Lufthansa 4545. KLM 814, Monitor Unicom, bye bye. Monitor Unicom, KLM 814, bye bye. Left hand to 782, Monitor Unicom, bye bye. Unicom, uh, left hand to 782, bye bye. On control, good afternoon, DJ 861 Yankee, 155 for 4000. Easy, 861 Yankee, London, hello, climb to level 130. Up to 130, easy, 861 Yankee. Lane 7 Alpha Hotel, turn left heading 245. Left heading 245, B Line 7 Alpha Hotel.
Beeline 7 Alpha Hotel, 35 miles, run May 27 right, descend altitude 4,000 feet, QNH 1010. Descend uh, 4,000 feet, altitude QNH 1010, Beeline 7 Alpha Hotel. Easy 861 Yankee, turn left heading 350, climb flight level 190. Up to 190, and what's heading again? Sorry, is it 861 Yankee? Easy 861 Yankee, turn left heading 350. Heading 350, is it 861 Yankee? Left hand to cargo 4545, monitor Unicom, bye bye. Unicom for Lufthansa Cargo 4545. Easy 8294, monitor Unicom, bye bye. Unicom 122, that's Malay, PC 804, thank you, bye bye. B line 7 Alpha Hotel, when established localizer, 27 right, descend glide path. Once established localizer, 27 right, descend glide path for B line 7 Alpha Hotel. Easy 861 Yankee, resume on navigation, direct Potton, Papa, Oscar, Tango, Oscar, November. We're doing well on navigation and direct to port in it's it's for Yanka. Easy 861 Yankee Monitor, Unicom, bye bye. On a Unicom, Easy 861 Yankee, bye bye. Easy 8 Whiskey Bravo with you at 3,000 through to 6,000. Easy 8 Whiskey Bravo, London, hello, climb flat level 130. Climb flat level 130, Easy 8 Whiskey Bravo. Control, uh, good afternoon. Uh, flight point Alpha, flight level 215. Listening flight level uh, 100. Just overhead, uh, no inbound so far. And got QNH 1011 at uh, London City. Flyer 48 Alpha London, hello. Cleared LAV 01 Golf transition, runway 27, route direct RAV star. Descend flight level 80, high speeds approved. I cleared LAV 01 Golf. Direct route to descent flight level 80 via 8548 Alpha. Easy 84 Whiskey Bravo, turn right heading 045. Turn right heading 045, Easy 8 Whiskey Bravo. Easy 8 forward ski bravo, climb flight level 230. Climb flight level 230, easy 8 forward ski bravo. Fly forward alpha, just confirm high speed was approved. Flyer for it alpha AFM. Thank you.
EZ84 Whiskey Bravo, re correction, resume on navigation direct to Gazba Golf Alpha Sierra Bravo Alpha. Direct Gazba uh, for EZ84 Whiskey Bravo. B lane 7 out for total surface wind 210 degrees, 1 2 knots, from me 27 right, clear to land. Clear to land, B lane 7 out for hotel. B lane 7 out for hotel, just confirm, from me 27 right. 27 right, clear to land, B lane 7 out for hotel. Thank you. Easy 8 for Whiskey Bravo, monitor Unicom, Joe. Joe Unicom, thanks very much, uh, Easy 8 for Whiskey Bravo. Easy 8323 London. Uh, London Control, good afternoon. Easy 86 Charlie Bravo with you, flight level 190. Uh, information puffer on board for Gallic. Easy 86 Charlie Bravo, London, hello, Class 6 1 Golf arrival, Red Direct Willow, when ready, descend point level 130. Uh, Class 6 1 Golf uh, arrival, uh, proceed direct to Willow, and when ready, descend to flight level 130, just confirm, Easy 86 Charlie Bravo. Easy 86 Charlie Bravo, yes, sir. Easy 8323 with you, Bus 6000. Easy 8323, London, hello, climb to level 230. 230, Easy 8323. London Control, good evening, is this 6-3 de Mazuru, the French at level 150, from Kiwi. Stacey, can I verify EZ-36 de Mazuru? Ah, sorry, EZ-36 de Mazuru. EZ-36 de Mazuru, London, hello, Squawk 2054, Desert 1 Gulf Arrival. Squawk 2054, this is 1 Gulf Arrival, EZ-36 de Mazuru. London Control, good air right now, fire whiskey, Line 5 left 360, inbound tropics. Right now, fire whiskey, London, hello, I don't cover the high areas of London, monitor Yenico. Roger that, thank you. Easy 86, Charlie Bravo, descend to level 80, high speed approved. 80 high speed for you to 86 Charlie Bravo. Easy 8323, monitor Unicom, bye bye. Unicom, easy 8323. Flyer 48 Alpha, descend altitude 6000 feet, QNH 1011. 6000 feet on QNH 1011, Flyer 48 Alpha. Mic on. Hiya, Snow. Got my mic working there. There we go. How are you? Easy 36 limits. They just confirmed squawk 2054.
Line 7 Alpha Hotel, vacated Alpha 9 Reco. B Lane 7 Alpha Hotel, taxi right Alpha, Echo, left Bravo, stand 224. <laughs> no worries, no right worries. Right Alpha, Echo, left Bravo, 124 for B Lane 7 Alpha Hotel. B Lane 7 Alpha Hotel, negative stand 224. Stand 224, B Lane 7 Alpha Hotel, sorry for that. Hello Control, very good afternoon, Ryan. Glad to have you. For you descend in front level 178. I'm going to get my uh, clearance from ATC in a minute. Ryan Air 244 London, hello, Squawk 7651, Desit 1, Gulf Arrival. Squawk 7651, Desit 1, Gulf Arrival, Ryan Air 244. Hello Control, good afternoon. I will if I can get a word in. Oh, does it? Well, let me change that. Easy 36 Tango, Quebec, London, hello, Desit 1, Gulf Arrival, Descent, Fly Level 150, Level by Kidley. Then fly level 150, that's it, one golf and uh, 150 by Kidley, uh, EC36, thank you, Quebec. EZ36 limited, maintain flight level 150, speed 300 knots or greater. Maintain 150, speed 300, greater, EZ36, Ramadulu. Uh. Ryanair 244, descent flight level 150 level by Kidley, speed 280 knots. Speed 280, RC7, got level 150 by Kidley, right air 2.1. Easy 36 Tango, Quebec, speed 250 knots or less. Speed 250 knots or less, easy 36 Tango. London Control, Golf, Mike, Mike, Julia, actually, he's on the ground at Leon Solent, uh, IFR to Jersey, from Western Airway, joint clearance at Fred. Golf Mike, Mike, Jira XC, London Control, hello. Are you routing southwest by after the departure? Are you going northeast? Uh, we'll be routing to the southwest to join the Quebec 4 1 airway at Fred. Golf Mike, Mike, Jira XC. Golf Jira XC, Roger, in that case, I'll be with you in a come 1 2 2, definitely. Roger, thanks. Long control, good afternoon, speedbird 760 at stand 509 at Heathrow, ready for clearance to Oslo. Speedbird 760 London, hello, clear to Oslo, Britman's Park 7 Gulf, Squawk 7027. Clear to Oslo by Brookman 7 Gulf departure on Squawk 7027, speedbird 760. Speedbird 760, correct. Uh, my departure. Yeah, Atlantic Control, good day, Skyways 141, type 737800. Information, Bravo, request and clearance to Dublin is filed. Skyways 141, London, clear to Dublin, Compton 3, Gulf, Squawk 7277. Compton 3, Gulf 7277, Skyways 141. Skyways 141, correct. Uh. There we go, that's boarding complete. Fire for it, Alpha, when ready, descend altitude 4,000 feet. Where's the ATIS? Where's the ATIS? 18550, London, hello, taxi straight ahead, hold November Bravo 2 Echo, runway 27 left. Uh, it is a l it's exactly like real ATC. Um, the guys who uh, who do this, some of them are actual Easy controllers. Bravo, fly heading zero five five five. Uh, yeah, some of them are actual controllers at actual five real five airports. But the the VATSIM network requires that everything is in accordance with all the relevant uh, procedures. So it's really cool, really cool. Right, so, uh, my Brookman 7, uh, London Control, good afternoon, Speedbird 760, can you confirm runway for departure? Easy 
Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Herman's Holiday, exactly, yeah. Oh, okay. KLM 217, land control, login to hotel, arrival. Departure 27 right, okay, 27 right. No, that's seven. Oh, okay. No, no, no. And the uh, Stacy calling for the departure on my second. Uh, Speedbird two, seven six zero. Is it two seven left for the departure runway at Heathrow? Speedbird seven six zero. A firm is eight is wrong. Uh, yeah, a, a firm. Yeah, eight is saying um, departure is two seven right. Speedbird seven six zero. Roger. Thank you for that information. Charlie's now current, and that's great. Uh, Roger, now got information, Charlie, Speedboat 760, thanks. KLM 217, contact London, 127, so, decimal 1, bye-bye. Uh, bu 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 Transition level 75, uh, 1010. Easy 86, Charlie Bravo, 28 miles, runway 26 left, descend altitude 2,000 feet, QNH 1011. Yeah, 2000 track miles received, uh, QNH 1011, easy 850 Charlie Bravo. Onto auto. Atlantic Control, Skyways 141, stand 225, requesting push and start. Skyways 141, push and start is correction. Skyways 141 after the A320 bind is cleared, push and start approved, face east. Uh, departure. Copy that. Uh, behind the A320, push and start, face east, Skyways 141. Adrian 550, did you get a clearance from the previous controller? Yeah, Brooklyn 7 Golf. Affirmative, Adrian 550. Adrian 550, thanks. Fine, November Bravo 2 Echo, runway 27 left, surface wind 210 degrees, 1 2 knots, nope. it's clear for takeoff. Yeah, but it's Six thousand. Flyer four three alpha when ready, descend up to three thousand feet, one established localizer on me two seven, descend on the glide path. So three thousand feet, one on the localizer two seven, descend with the glide, fly forward alpha. Easy three sixty Mazulu, speed two five zero knots or greater, when ready, descend flight level eight zero. Okay. Departed performance. Planes Ryanair two four four speed. Hello, two, five, W Davies. Speed 250 knots, Welcome Ryanair to the channel. Uh, okay, so packed on, no tow, guarantee ice off. Speedbird 57, London, hello, cleared. Correction, Speedbird 57, you filed from Munich, are you going to Frankfurt or Munich? Dry runway. Frankfurt, sorry, I returned it. 60.9, 60.9, oh, we take off, yeah, of course. And Temperature is 17 now, so let's get now out of the box. Speedbird 57, I don't think I have a clearance to Frankfurt. Speedbird 57, I don't see the update yet. Could you try reconnecting? That should work. Acknowledged. Easy 36 Tanger Quebec, request descent. Easy 36 Tanger Quebec, negative. 131. One three one and one three four. Flyer four eight alpha surface uh, wind one creation two one zero degrees eight knots from me two seven cleared to land. Two cleared to land runway two seven flyer uh, point alpha. Two easy eight six Charlie Bravo turn left heading two nine zero cleared at its approach from me two six left. Sixty eight. Two nine zero cleared at its approach uh, two six left easy eight six Charlie Bravo. Easy 360 Missoula, turn left heading 095. Left to 095, we will take the Missoula. Ryanair 244, descend flight level 80. Descend flight level 80, Ryanair 244. Easy 41, Papa November 3600, out of Gatwick. Easy 41, Papa November, London, turn right heading 280, climb altitude 6000 feet. Oh, thanks for the follow. Uh, uh, right, 280, uh, 6,000 feet, easy for one, Papa, remember. 
Ryanair 244, flight heading 130. 130 degrees, Ryanair 244. Adrian 550, report your passing out. Level Just tweak the volume levels. Are they all right? On the control, hello, is that one eight five Delta with you? Flight level one six zero for one five zero Compton one Sierra. It was good before, was it? Oh, one eight five okay. Delta. Is it bad now? Report aggressive level. Oh, cool, cool. Chris, flight level eight zero one eight five Delta. Sorry, is that one eight zero one seven zero? Uh eight zero zero eight zero. We're in the okay. So before start check this, five Delta Russia is complete. Fire is one zero one zero. Let's get that in the emergency box as well. Easy eight six channel bravo, cut to Gary Tower, eight six channel bravo, call Sedoni, one two four decimal two two five, great. Eight cars initialized, parking brake. Set. Fuel on board is Easy four one Papa November climb for level one four zero. Climb level one four zero. Unit B is loaded. Flex temp sixty eight. Takeoff speed one two one. Easy three six Lima speed two two zero knots or greater. Pack signs are on and auto. Uh, oh, actually, that's for our start clearance. We haven't got start clearance yet. Our Flight APN is due 550 to leave. Midhurst, one X ray arrival, Gatwick. In 20 minutes. Company message. What's the company message? Oh, it's the load sheet. Cool. And that confirms our zero fuel weight of 53.5 tons. And our CG is. 38.1 uh, uh, uh. London Patrol, KLM 342 with you. Five. KLM 342, London, hello, yep, climb level 130. Climb 130, 342. 38.1. Looking at Joel, Speedbird 2 off mic with you, standing slightly okay, level 9 at 0. Speedbird 2 off mic, London, Roger. EZ41, Papa November, turn left, heading 230. Left 230, EZ41, Papa November. Zap 185 Delta, descend flight level 80, high speed approved. 80, high speed approved, Zap 185 Delta, thanks. Skyways 141, ready for taxi. Skyways 141, okay. taxi, Bravo, and then first right, hold November, Bravo 3. Taxi, Bravo, first right, November, Bravo 3. Skyways 141. Check the load sheet. Commander Control, speed, bird 7907, kilo, refuel, uh, 4 miles this road, descending through flight level 180. Speed, bird 797, kilo, London, Roger. Easy four one Papa November, resume on navigation direct to All God, Oscar Lima Golf Unit from Delta. Direct All God easy uh four one Papa November. KLM three four two turn left heading zero four five left zero four five three four two strobes to auto. Easy three six tango Quebec, when are we Love expecting a descent? Easy three six tango Quebec, the next descent flat level nine zero. Descent flight level 90, EC36, Tango Quebec. EC41, Papa November, Monocy, Unicom, bye. For Unicom, EC41, Papa November, see ya. Ryanair 244, turn left, heading 080, speed 220 knots. Unicom. Left turn 080 degrees, down to 220 knots on the speed, Ryanair 244. So we're ready. EC36, Lima Zulu, turn left, heading 080, descend altitude 3000 feet, QNH 1011. Uh, this is an A320 stow, sorry to disappoint. <laughs> Speedbird 2 Alpha, Mike, leave Lamborn heading 265. Okay. Leave Lamborn heading 265, 2 Alpha, Mike. KLM 342 heading to London, 127.1, bye. 
the... 127 decimal 1 with the he bed heading, sorry. Get rid of the GPU two. and the chocks. Rhino 244, descend altitude 4,000 feet, turn H1011. Turn H1011 down to 4,000 feet, Rhino 244. Speed post 760, stand 509 at Heathrow, ready for push and start. Speed bridge 760, under control, KLM 342, with you heading 145, 045. Speed bridge 760, push and start at Face Face South, speed bridge 760, thanks. Skyways 1 for 1, so beacons on, transponder is auto. Closed. Let's check the doors page and make sure. Doors closed and armed. Easy 36 Tango Quebec, turn left heading 080, descend for the full 80, speed 220 knots. Okay. Left 080, descend 80, speed 220 knots, easy 36 Tango Quebec. Speed bridge 797 kilo, descend for the full 90, speed 220 knots. Descend line level 90, speed 220 knots, speed bridge 797 kilo. So south for us is nose left. Fire white mic vacated. Hello, Captain. Hello, Captain. Hello, Captain. Flyer 4A Alpha, saying key taxi stand 3, crash A from stand 3. Stand 3, thanks very much for your help. Uh, Flyer white Alpha. Uh, Flyer white Alpha. KLM 217 London, hello, leave Lamborn heading 265. Departure to Lamborn 265. My gun's pin inserted. AZ36, same as Zulu, turn left heading 295. Left to 295, AZ36, my gun's pin. AZ36, Tango Quebec, descend altitude 4000 feet, QNH 1011. Descend 4000, QNH 1011, EZ36, Tango Quebec. AZ5, 550, speed 220 knots. Speed 220 knots. Tap 185 Delta, Molen to Unicom, bye. Unicom 185 Delta, good evening. Speed bridge 2 Alpha Mike, descend altitude 4000 feet, QNH 1010, landing 27 right. Descend 4000 feet, QNH 1010, and landing 27 right, Speed bridge 2 Alpha Mike. London B line 7 Alpha Hotel, stand 224, information Charlie 8320, ready to copy. B line 7 Alpha Hotel London, no Most flight plan. Left, tail right. I'll check. Mm -hmm. Speed bridge 2 Alpha Mike, left heading 130. Flight level 3 for 190. Speed bridge 2 Alpha Mike, left heading 130. Release parking brakes. 130, 0 to Mike. I don't have one. Eight, I, I'm London. solo crew today. Interesting routing there. Turn left heading 350. Uh, release parking brakes. Left heading 350. Easy 36 speed 180 knots for greater. Clear okay. that as approach. Start engine 2. Speed 180 knots for greater, speed for the other 26 left. Easy 36 knots. Normal B line 9, Bravo. Stand 224 in for Charlie, 8320. Ready to copy. B line 9, 3 Bravo. Stand by number 1. I have PDC online if you read my information. London Logan 34 to get Delta, descending flight for 60 inbound Raptor. Logan 34 to get Delta, London Raptor. Rhino 244, turn left heading 350, descend altitude to 3000 feet. Left turn 350 degrees down to 3000 feet, Rhino 244. Let's get the uh, airport chart. Skyway 5780, climb so level 170. Climbing 170, could you uh, confirm the heading you gave me? Ground chart is... Skyway 5780, heading 350. You turned the wrong direction after the departure, so I need to get you out the way of the Gatwick arrivals. Uh, okay, confirmed. So, 27 left our departure. We're over here, so we're, I'm guessing he's going to give us either Skyway Alpha or Bravo. One report passing altitude to climb to level one five I'm guessing two. Alpha, because they usually give us Skyway Alpha. One for one, passing five alpha down to 27, all the way down to the other end of the airport. Pioneer 244, speed 180 knots. Uh, 180 knots, Ryanair 244. 
We'll see which uh, which intersection they give us. Five five zero, descend out to four thousand feet. KNH one zero one one. Waiting your confirmation for good engine start. Okay, let's get engine two going. Skyways five seven eight zero. It, turn it, left it is. Two yes, two it, it definitely is. Definitely less than turn one. Turn left parsec. heading two two five. Skyways five seven eight zero. FedEx two two seven. Fox at London. Yes, FedEx 27 Fox, I was just about to call you. We're Correct. currently on 5000. FedEx 227 Fox, climb to level 110. 110, FedEx 27 Fox, Road. Speed bridge 2 Alpha Mike, turn right, heading 245, when established localizer, 27 right, descend on the right. <laughs> turn right, 245 degrees, when established 27 right, descend on the local air uh, glide bath, 2 itself, Mike. Easy 36 Tango Quebec, turn left, heading 350. Left heading 350, EC 36, Tango Quebec. EC 36, Lima Zulu, roger. Ryanair 244, turn left heading 290, one established localizer, 26 left, descend flight path. There we go, left available. Good engine start. Ryanair 244. You can disconnect. B-Line 93 Bravo, cleared to Brussels. Watch 2. Detling 2 Golf, Squawk 0, 1, 0, 5. Anti skid is on. Squawk 0105, uh, Beeline 9 3 Bravo. Beeline 9 3 Bravo, correct. Brake, brake, easy 36 Tango Quebec, speed 180 knots. Speed 180 knots, easy 36 Tango Quebec. ATN 550, turn left, heading 065. Taxi lights on, turn off lights on. Unlocking gear. Speed bridge 797 kilo, fly heading 050, descend flight level 80. Flying 050, the same 80, speed at 797 kilos. Skyways 141, one for one, monitor Unicorn, by. Big, two, three, disconnected. Bypass, Unicorn, skyways 141, thank you. Easy 36, Lima Zulu, speed 160 knots, maintain 4 Lima. That's a lot of loops. Easy 36, Lima Zulu, contact tower, 124.25, bye bye. My gone. My gone. KLM 217, turn left heading 120, descend altitude 4000 feet, KNH 1010. Left heading 120, 4000 feet, KNH 1010. Yeah. London High, speedbird 566, block to 1 XL, I'd like 5000 feet. There's a little guy, give me a wave, show me he's got the tag. Give us a wave, give us a wave. FedEx 227 Foxhot, climb to level 180. No bugger off. There you go. Okay, let's get taxi clearance. Easy 267 Yankee, London, climb to level 130. Level 130, easy. Easy 36 Tango Quebec, turn left heading 290, let's do the uh, localizer, 26 left, descend glide path. Left heading 290, so and when is that? Easy normal. Glide path, easy 36 Tango Quebec. Logan 340 at Delta, when ready, descend out to 4000. Two on flight control checks. Full up, full down, neutral. Right now 244, speed 160, maintain to 4 DME. Full right, neutral. Rudder, Asian full 550, right, turn left, heading three full five left, zero, speed one eight zero neutral. Flight control checks complete. Brian Air two four four, contact Gabby Tower one two four, speed brakes two two five by one two four, that's all two two five. Brian Air two four four, good day. Speedboat seven six zero, ready for taxi. Eight two zero, very good. Brian Air two four four, be two two club. Uh, Somebody was talking over you then. Uh, turn 180, 5780. Skyways 5780, AFRAM, and climb side of 190. And climb 190, Skyways 5780. FedEx 227 Foxhot, monitor Unicom, Unicom, FedEx 227 Foxhot, bye bye. Speedbird 2 Alpha Mike, surface wind 190 degrees, 10 knots, from my 27 right, cleared to land. 27 right, clear to land, speedbird 2 off mic. Let's turn that KLM off now that the engines are on. Right heading 2-4-5, established localizer, 2-7 right, descend glide path. 
Yeah. He's a busy boy today. Speedbridge 797 Kilo, descend altitude 4000 feet, KNH 1011. Descend 4000 KNH, uh, Speedbridge 797 Kilo. Speedbridge 2566, Monas to Unicom, bye. Unicom, Bobby. Speedbird 760, ready for taxi. Stand by. Easy 36 Tango Quebec, speed 160 knots, maintain to 4 DME. 160 knots until 4, easy 36 Tango to Quebec. Easy 367 Yankee, turn left heading 340. Still not turn 340, just reset 790. Asian 550, turn left heading 290, descend altitude 3000 feet, one established localizer, 26 left, descend on the glide path. Easy 36 Tango Quebec, contact Gatwick Tower, 124, decimal 225, g'day. Over to Gatwick Tower, 124, 225, Easy 36 Tango Quebec. Speedbird 797 Kilo, turn left heading 3. Gatwick Tower, good afternoon. Quebec on uh, 7 mine final. Speedbird 797 Kilo, turn left heading 330. Left heading 330, Speedbird 797 Kilo. Skyway 5780, resume our navigation direct to Zidl, X-ray, India, Delta, India, Lima. Logan 340 at Delta, descend altitude 3000 feet, one established localizer, runway 27, descend glide path. Descend 3000 feet, one established localizer, descend glide path, runway 27, Logan 340 at Delta. Speedbird 2 Alpha Mike, this traffic entering 278, not in contact with me. Continue if you wish. Continue in, Speedbird 2 Alpha Mike. Easy 367 Yankee, uh, level 190. He could level use. So, so this guy. Speedbird 797 Kilo, turn left heading 280. One established localizer, runway 26 left, descend glide path, speed 180. This guy is managing this area, the, the south big white bit but he's also managing Heathrow and Gatwick and Biggin Hill and London City so he's a busy boy he's a busy busy boy easy 367 Yankee report heading to London 127.1 bye bye I, I did have a um, a controller at Heathrow, but he logged off just Asian as I came online. Zero, contact Gatwick Tower, one two four decimal two two five. Good day. So because we've got a London North or London Central, one two seven point one two zero. It might be him. So I'll just put that in the radio Super ready. Alpha Mike, right Alpha, send 507. Right Alpha, 507, zero Alpha Mike. 18550, contact Tower, 124 decimal 225. Oh, Tower's online. Oh no, that's Gatwick. Speedbird 760, ready for taxi. Speedbird 760, taxi Alpha, hold November Bravo 3. Taxi Alpha, hold November Bravo 3, Speedbird 760. London Control, hello, Ryan. So let's find out where November Bravo 3 is. Uh, it's the First one of the holds. Rhino three one eight London have okay. you contacted Tower. Uh, I don't see if Tower is uh, online. Rhino three one eight from one two four decimal two two five. They should be there after not just wait, they'll be back. Okay, thank you. London control viewing four the mic, that will be one four zero at T plus. Zero Wings 4, Romeo Mike, London, hello, Rick Direct, Mike Alpha, Yankee. 
And we're underway at last. Uh, direct Mike, Alpha Yankee, you in for me, Mike. KLM217, uh, there's traffic that is not on my frequency on the runway 27 right. The surface wind 190 degrees, 10 knots, runway 27 so right, clear to land, continue or you can go around. We're supposed to depart, well actually we're five minutes, so we're, fi we're actually five minutes early. So Logan, we're not doing too bad. Departure time is 14.55. Okay, after start, ground equipment removed, anti-ice off, flaps config 2, uh, APU is off, electric pump is off, trims are set, cabin doors are on, decom status checked. Before takeoff, flight controls checked. TCAS TARA, departure brief confirmed. Brooklyn 7 part departure. So we're banking to the right on departure. Uh, takeoff data and FMA is set. Flaps is 2. Econ memo takeoff no blue. And then we'll figure the rest when we get to the runway. Delhi, Detling to go, squawk 4453. From uh, London Radar, that's you, me, Keith. Air India 116, did you get any of that? Yeah, we're close to Delhi on the Captain 2's box, right? Please, focus 554 three, three, three for Air India 116. Air India 116, negative 44. Oh, there's across the pod event today. 445. Four, so, London to America. Air India Or UK to America. So, that'll be why there's a lot of traffic at the minute. KLM 217, taxi right alpha, echo, left bravo, Romeo. I'm surprised there's nobody on tower or ground though. Logan 340 at Delta, thanks, taxi stand 7. Delta, Logan 340 at Delta. Speed 7, 97 kilos, speed 160 knots, maintain to 40 meters. Speed 160 knots, maintain to 40 meters. So that's length 53 to Bravo. Hello, F2 Echo Mike, uh, flight level 4000. Is link 53 to Alpha. Climb flight level 130 for the Swing Comet. There we go. Alpha. Favorite 797 kilo, contact Gatwick Tower. 124, decimal 225, bye bye. 124, decimal 225, speed 5973, bye bye. Springbok 190, London. But seven nine seven kilo on two six left to Confirm zero seven six zero for the guidance of Pakistan. Swapping zero seven six zero guidance to Pakistan. Favorite 72 London, where are you calling? Air France 22 Echo Mike, turn left heading 040. Turn left heading 040 Air France 2 Echo Mike. Yellow Wings 4 Romeo Mike, turn right heading 265. Turn right, heading 265, you're in for me, Mike. Got me good afternoon, see the 70 with. Speed 
Seabird 72, say again, you're broken. Seabird 72, where is your new Bedex on Hotel? Oh, hang on, I've got someone at the door. Seabird 72, Scott 76006. I've got put the brakes on. 7606, Seabird 72. Eurowing 4, Romeo Mike, 35 miles, 26 left, descend out to deep 4,000 feet, QNH 1011. Uh, descent 4,000 feet, QNH 1011, Eurowing 4, Romeo Mike. My lovely wife. No! <laughs> the plane, no! Ryanair 318, London, hello, clear to Munich, getting to Gulf, squawk 5422. Clear to Munich, as plan, prepare to Gulf, departure, squawk 4522, Ryanair Air France, two echo mic before heading to London, one two seven decimal one, bye bye. Um, uh, two two other five. Plane control, good afternoon. Nordic eight, please to Tango. Flight level one zero six four nine zero. Logan, two hotel arrival. Our decade with you, Tango London, Roger, break break, Air France 22 Echo Mike heading to London, 127 decimal 1. Contacting near London on 127 decimal 1, Air France 22 Echo Mike. Speedbird 72, leave Ockham heading 075. Leave Ockham 075, Speedbird 7. I don't know why, but Radio 2 was uh, bleeding through there. That's a bit of a bug, I think. Radio 2 shouldn't be audible unless I press that button there. So, November Bravo 3 I'm looking for. That's November 5 Whiskey. So, I think we're the next one along. Oh no, 5 Whiskey, 5 Echo, uh, 4 no, Whiskey, 4 whiskey, Echo, tango, turn and then um, 230 Descend altitude 6,000 feet, QNH 1010. Left turn heading 230, descend altitude uh, 6,000 feet, QNH 1010, Nordic 8 Whiskey Tango. <laughs> Gear wing 4, Romeo Mike, 1 established on the localizer, runway 26 left, descend on the glide path. When established on the localizer, 26 left, uh, descend with the glide path, Gear wing 4, Romeo Mike. Hang on, there's 318, on got week, ready to jump back. Stay for coming, can't wait, okay, don't cover it. There's a tower on line, 124, 225. 124, 225, Sorry, was that Ryan here, 318 again? Yes. Ryanair 318 on the heater. Ryanair 318, Roger. You're making me get mixed up as much as you're mixed up. Uh, push and start to approved. Face set. Push and start to approved. Face set. Ryanair 318, thank you. Nordic 8 Whiskey Tango, descend altitude 4,000 feet. Descend 4,000 feet, Nordic 8 Whiskey Tango. Four whiskey. If you hadn't guessed yet, this is exit 4 west and the other one's exit 4 east. They're exits from the runway when they're landing on 09. Okay, Whiskey Tango, when established localizer, runway 27 right, descend on the glide path. Once established on localizer 27 right, descent via the glide path. Oh, not again. Let's get tangled. All stations landed back in two minutes. Ah, lovely. Control has disappeared. <laughs> OK, 
Okay. Uh, so our last checklist items are take off runways to seven left, strobes on and packs on, strobes on and packs are on. Cool. Lights. camera and ready for action at least and this is November th Bravo 3 Year of Wing 4, Romeo Mike, cut to Gatwick Tower 124, that's more 225, bye bye one to four, two to five, you follow me, Mike. Thank you very much. Speedbird 760, ready for departure. Speedbird 760, thanks. Fine, I've had my Bravo 3, surface wind 180 degrees, 7 out. New UK H1010, runway 27 left, clear for takeoff. Fine, November Bravo 3, runway 27, clear takeoff, Speedbird 760. Speedbird 7 to 26 miles, 27 right, descend altitude 4,000 feet, QNH 1010. 4,000 feet, QNH 1010, Yeah, the other station coming again. Ryanair 318 on Heathrow, ready to taxi. Ryanair 318, taxi Alpha, hold November Bravo 3. Taxi Alpha, hold November Bravo 3, Ryanair. Moving control, hello, Skyways 503 with the flight level 140. Skyways okay. 503, London, hello, Richard. Feet on the tow brakes. Descent level 80, high speed approved. 50%, wait for stabilise. Direct timber and flight level 080 and uh, no speed restriction. Stabilised off the tow brakes. Man Flex SRS Runway Auto Throttle Blue. Rotate. Navigate with Katango fully established to seven right. Positive right, gear up. Nordic 8 Whiskey Tango, surface wind 180 degrees, 7 knots from me, 27 right, clear to land. Clear to land, 27 right, Nordic 8 Whiskey Tango. Speedboard 72, turn left, heading 340, descend out to 3,000 feet. 340, 3,000 feet. Flaps up, climb thrust. Down and stop the bank to the right. Air India one one six, fish start to And get the autopilot in. Oh, no autopilot. Why no autopilot? Hello, London. Ah, below green dot speed. Okay. Come on, put your, yeah, put your nose down for. Yeah, blue London, hello, climb for the 150. 150, London. Speedbird 72, turn left, heading 300. There we one go. Established low climber, 27 right, descend climb back. Okay, flaps up. 300, and then went on the earth line. So, taxi lights off. Speedbird 760, contact London, 127, decimal 1, bye bye. Was that for me? Paper 760, London, 127.1, bye. London on 127.1, speed 760, thanks, bye bye. Speed 760, thanks, bye bye. London, Skyway 4811, back with you. Roger. 
London Speedbird 760 passing 4,700 for 6,000 QNH 1010. Brookman 7 part uh, 7 Golf departure from Heathrow. Speedbird 760 London, hello, identified claim now, flight level 80. Flight level 80, Speedbird 760. Fraction 62, contact London, frequency 134, decimal 125, bye bye. London, off we go, decimal 125, uh, thank you much, have a good day. Uh, fraction 162. Uh, 8 0. 8 thousand feet. QNH 13 Romeo, push start proof, QNH 1010. 8 thousand feet. Manage mode. Right, F7 uniform kilo, contact London, 129 decimal 425. 129 decimal 425, uh, right, F7 uniform kilo, thanks, bye. We'll do an open climb. Papa at stand, uh, at Alpha 1. Push. Easy 592, Papa, do you require a backtrack? Yes. 7,500, so... 92 Papa, enter backtrack, runway 25, report ready for departure. Enter backtrack, runway 25, all reports ready for departure. 1013, stand by. Speedbird 760, climb flight level 150. Flight level 150, Speedbird 760. 150. Skyway is 4811, when ready, descend flight level 200, level Elvos. And ready down to 200, level over. Go on, for it, one one. Go off, Hotel Alpha, Whiskey Kilo, London, you still alt with climb. me? Uh, open climb, Alt Blue. Up to 15,000 feet. Ryanair 45 Tango, ready for push. Oh, sorry, Ryanair 611, ready for push. Ryanair 611, you can push straight back. QNH is 1008. Push straight back, 1008, Ryanair 611. Okay. After takeoff, landing gears up, ECAM is checked. Speedboat 760, route direct lead. Past 10,000 now, so. Direct lead bow speedbird 760. Direct to. Lead bow. Insert. There we go. So back on my pretty little graph, uh, pretty little map even. Air France 22 Echo Mike, no further ATC, continue with Unicom, au revoir. Continue on Unicom, au revoir. Thank you for your control. Yeah, I'm going to take a Papa, Papa, lined up and ready on way to C5. So I'll be going over on to... QG 509, oh. Papa, on the control, hello. Uh, London Central. Off. Uh, 25170 degrees, 4 knots. And I'm already on London Central. Yes. 127.1. So the next one will be Unicom. So let's get Unicom in the box right now. 122 decimal 8. Ready to go. There we go. There's London for you. Speedbird 760, claim now, flight level 350. Flight level 350 for Speedbird 760, thank you. And 350 is our cruising altitude, so that's nice. Skyway is 4811, no further ATC, over to Unicom 122 decimal 8, bye bye. You can now get up and move around, use the toilets, etc. Ryan F4 Charlie Whiskey, direct Abtum. Direct Abtum, Ryan F4 Charlie Whiskey. 
Okay. Oh, Charlie Whiskey, did I advise you to start Temper 2 Golf? A fan Temper 2 Golf, I left for Charlie Whiskey. Thanks. AG-592, Papa, report your passing altitude. AG-592, Papa, Roger, standby. UG-592, Papa, climb now, flight level 8-0. UG-592, Papa, you can route direct well in. Can you actually open those? No, you can't open those, that's a shame. Right Air 4, Charlie Whiskey, contact London Control, 134, decimal 125, good afternoon. 134 double 125, right F4, Charlie Whiskey, fine, thank you. <laughs> the autopilot is flying the plane. You've seen airplane, haven't you? That big inflatable pilot. Yep. Because watch this. Uh, two, one, two, I think I See? caught you both, Fine Air 6. There they are. One, one, you can Inflatable pilot and co pilot. Alpha, hold Alpha 1. <laughs> alpha 1, go out with Skeet Alpha Alpha. Uh, Channel X 1C Echo Romeo, was that you calling? Hey, man. Sorry, Channel X 1C Echo Romeo, have you pushed back here? It's a bit busy up here. Yep, we're ready for tapping. One C Echo Romeo, thanks taxi, Romeo, Romeo 1, Romeo 2, 2. So that's the route Romeo we're going to be taking. Good afternoon, I'm going to do this to EZ 628 Zulu, heading 345 with you. EZ 628 Zulu, London Control. Hello, identified. Route direct, port on. Papa, Oscar, Tango, Oscar, November. Direct Porton is the 628. So that's that's our route. We're off the route a little bit because it gave us a direct to somewhere probably about here or here. Just enough to get me out of his airspace. Which is... UG628 Zulu, claim flight level 360. There's me. Climbing 360 easy, 6280. Easy 592, Papa, climb flight level 380. That's me there. That's his airspace that I'm talking to. And as soon as I get out into here, he'll pass me over to the, the, great, uh, the great void. Yep. Left hand 22 Alpha, contact London 129, decimal 425. Where it really is like the Wild West. Contact London on Where there are no controllers. Thank you, good Inbound table 5,000 feet. Um. Lady pilot, love to hear it. Gen X 122 London, hello, climb flight level 9, uh, correction, 190. Climb flight level 190, Gen X 122. 
Standard Control, good afternoon, EG14, Bob Echo, heading 300, flat level 360. EG14, Bob Echo, London, hello, maintain that heading just now. Maintain heading, EG14, Bob Echo. So, flight plan. We're expected into Oslo at 1648, time is now 1516, so about an hour and a half. Let's see if we can get the weather at Oslo. Seabird 760, no further ATC, continue to Unicom 122 decimal 8, bye bye. Over to Unicom 122 decimal 8, thanks for your service, bye bye, Speedbird 760. There we go, passed into the great void. There are no controllers here. This is where we just speak to everybody in the area. Okay, so, weather request, uh, Echo November Golf mic for Gardamoen, and I want the Metal please, in fact I'll have the TAF as well, just in case it's going to be different. Received messages. We've got the weather data. So let's take a close look at that. So the metal on the 22nd at 14:50. Variable at one knot. Oh, okay, that's nice. 10 kilometres visibility. Few at 1,800. Broken clouds at 2,100. Temperature zero five. Ooh, chilly. And QH of 1009. No significant change. Uh, the TAF is uh, from uh, 12. Oh, so it's covering the 24 hour period. 020 at zero, zero, 5 knots, 10 kilometers broken, becoming. Oh, becoming. Ooh. Well, I'm glad we're not uh, landing between 8 and 10 tonight because that's 600 metres visibility with freezing fog. So, glad I'm not flying at that time. Yeah, you can have a go at <laughs> do a flip. <laughs> you can have a go at driving the plane, yeah. get that tough into the performance data while we're at it shall we so approach 1009 temperature 5 Go on then, I'll sit back here, you can drive the plane. How's about that? <laughs> uh. Not really a gladiator person, to be honest. So while we're here, let's have a look at the approach. 
and the arrival. So the arrival were on a Belgo 3 Lima, which well, right, hang on, have I got that wrong? Flight plan. Let's uh, let's check my flight plan here. Uh, da, 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 da. Where are we? That's the alternate. Oh, Ripper three Lima. Uh, Ripper three Lima. Okay. Ripper a new one. Three Lima. from 3 Lima. Okay, so straight in. Then a DME arc. And then straight in there. Ready for the arrival. Which is ILS Cat 2, run by one left. So let's get them starred. So we're coming from Valpu. Oh, we're coming from Valpu. Oh, okay, well let's get that in the flight plan then. Uh, arrival via Valpu. Okay. So our arrival via Valpu and we need to be at three and a half thousand. And the cap Two ILS is a decision height of a uh, decision altitude of seven six five. So performance seven six five in the barrow. Okay. At cruise altitude. Carpet of cloud below us. That's pretty. Uh, decision altitude is uh, the altitude at which you must decide whether you're going to land or not. It's the, the altitude at which you must be able to see the runway. If you can't see the runway at decision altitude, you go around. That's very pretty. I like that. Now that's for a Cat 2. For a Cat 3. Oh! I don't know I could do that. Cockpit, please. Thank you. Okay, so for Cat 3B, you'll notice there isn't a decision height or a decision altitude. A Cat 3B is an auto land. So we can act. In fact, you know what? Let's let's do it. Let's do the auto land. Let's clear that, and let's put none in the radio 
Oh, is it in the barrow? Oh, no, it is not, no. No. In the barrow. And we are now set up for a Cat 3B approach. So as we get onto the approach, I enable the second autopilot, the two autopilots. Normally, only one will work at any one time. And it's all about the set, because there's two different sets of instruments. One on this side, one on this side. There's also two different sets of sensors. So, like the pitot tube and what have you. There's one on the left and there's one on the right. Um, so the autopilot basically says which one I'm taking my feed from. When we get into the approach, I click that button there, the approach button. And then I can have both of these on at the same time. And when I have them both on, it's a Cat 3B, and I can land. Oh, uh, it will auto land, rather. Yeah. Yeah, so, on a normal autopilot, it'll get you so far, and then you usually disconnect um, when you're at the decision altitude, or... Um, at some point before you touch down but uh, the auto land will land the plane and stop uh, stop you on the runway so it'll do the land the flare the rollout and stop you on the runway it's really cool and it's for situations where you just cannot see the runway at all I've never done an auto land before. I've always landed it manually. So this will be a new experience for me. Okay, so once I've got... Oh! Once I've got there... Where am I going? Uh, sufficiently agitated. Permission granted. Come aboard. We're, we're 30,000 feet, so... Uh, or 30, 35,000 feet, rather. So, um, yeah, come aboard before you suffocate. <laughs> okay, so we're on zero 01 left, which is that one. And where did British Airways land Oslo? I bet it was. That that's a hell of a climb. <laughs> they do. Generally speaking, yes. Yes, it's just wear on the ground. Uh, and we we so we, we if we land on this bit, we've got it wrong. If we land on any of this bit, we've got it really wrong. So, landing on this black bit there, and then it's just a case of where do we go from there. Which parking, which taxiways, etc. So, uh, I didn't want hotels. Terminal guides, Heathrow. There's uh, gates. Oslo Airport, British Airways. So this is actually a real flight. There is actually a Speedbird 760 that took off from Heathrow at the same time I did, ish. Um, so if I look on their website, uh, Speedbird 760, there it is. 
on route and on time yes I am <laughs> so that's parking at gate 9 terminal 3 ok well let's do that then shall we terminal 3 where are you uh, that's the airport parking stands uh, now gate 9 is not going to match the parking space is it that was just too much to hope for wasn't it although it might it might well let's try it shall we gate 9 which is a military terminal as well interesting that's the cargo area that's the military apron that's the general aviation area doesn't tell us which is terminal 1, 2 and 3 oh here we are, no no it doesn't tell us which is 1, 2 and 3 so we'll park there so we're coming off here uh, we'll come off at the exit down is that down Mike, yeah that's Mike and in at Kilo and gate 9 so Mike Kilo gate 9 okie dokie let's see if we can cut our journey short a little bit Go direct to Lanty. Uh, yeah, let's go direct Lanty. That'll cut a, a few minutes off the off the uh, arrival time for us. tell you what this looks amazing at night because you look down and you can see the the lights of all the towns and cities um, and of course it's geographically accurate so it's absolutely amazing I love it to bits this thing Come down, Mike. And yeah, come down, Mike. In at Kilo, and then Kilo One. That's important to Gate Nine. Let's make a note of that for later. Cool, 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 cool. Awesome. 
465 nautical miles to go. Oh, it's sufficiently agitated. Thank you for the follow, I've just noticed. I don't have any of those fancy whiz-bang alerts and shenanigans, not yet at least. Um, stream elements stuff. Still a noob. Very, very noob. But, uh, oh, the overlay's gone. There we go. Let's put that back up. At least you get a nice overlay so you can see where I'm going and ETA and stuff, which is nice. So how are we all doing, folks? Let's, uh, let's just do that. I've got um, failures, random failures enabled. So at any minute, I could get an alert in here saying something's gone terribly, terribly wrong. And at the minute, that would be a bad thing. Because um, uh, at the minute, I'm kind of out at sea quite a bit out at sea so that would be a bad situation if both of my engines gave up on me but yeah don't get the plane wet no <laughs> no no don't don't hope for that although do a little bit <laughs> Adds a little bit of spice to the flight. I think it was when I was flying to Rome on that last flight, I had a failure, but it was a minor, a minor electrical failure, so it wasn't too bad. <laughs> That's one hell of a bag of rice. Although, they, they're not too bad on water. Um, the, oh, what was this? What was this? Oh, Denmark Centre, 121375. Uh, one, okay. Got a message from a controller. Saying, contact me. <coughs> one, two, one, three, seven, five. So, ah, Copenhagen Control, Copenhagen Control, good afternoon, Speedbird 760 is with you, flight level 350. Speedbird 760, Copenhagen Control, hello, identified, clear direct tank. Uh, second clearance for Speedbird 760. Speedbird 760, clear to direct to Danko. Uh, I actually, uh, I'm currently direct to Lanty, Speedbird 760. Ah, Speedbird 760, Roger, no problem, sir. Proceed to Lanty. Correction, proceed to Lanty. Proceed to Lanty, Speedbird 760, thank you. Scanner 11, 1 Echo Kilo, 1027, clear for takeoff, wind to 200 degrees, 8 knots. That's because he's actually Danish. <laughs> so it looks like he's just come online because he wasn't there before. Descend altitude 
Dennis 152, start your distance. Can the name of one echo kilo identified two thousand feet to climb flight level one two zero? Climb flight level one two zero. Can the name of one echo kilo? Can the five four four three climb now flight level two one zero? Flight level two one zero for the factory. Uh come here again, good evening from the eight one three flight level two three zero bound code dog. Das ist Anzeige 18, Copenhagen Control, Squawk 2174. Squawk 2174, Lufthansa 813. Scan 115443, klärt direkt Trano, Tango, November, Oscar. Uh, can you repeat that message? Affirm, direct Tango, November, Oscar. Tango, November, Oscar, for the country. Lufthansa 813, identified flight level 245, climb now, flight level 360, and clear to direct agreement. Climb flight level 360. And direct remit, uh, climb through secure from the 813. Thank you. 813, just confirm uh, remit, Romeo, India, Mike, Eko, Tango. Uh, Roger, direct remit, uh, from the 813. Thank you, mate. Thank you. Rainer 68, Romeo, Quebec, establish uh, runway 27. Rainer 68, Romeo, Quebec, thank you. Runway 27, clear to land, wind 200 degrees, 8 knots. Runway 27, clear to land, thank you very much, Rainer 68, Romeo, Quebec. Can they even one echo kilo climb flight level 230? Flight level 230, can anyone echo kilo? Danish 152, descend flight level 50 and expect radar vectors for approach. Descend flight level 50. Scan the Raven 89 above our contact, Copenhagen approach, frequency 119, day summer 81. Approach 119, scan the Scanner Raven 1, Echo Hilo, clear the right turn, or Tango November Oscar. Clear the right turn, or November Oscar, scan the right turn, or November Oscar. Player 7, descend flight level 9, 0, contact Copenhagen approach, frequency 119, day summer 8, goodbye. Down to flight level 9, 0, and going to Copenhagen uh, 119, just late, maybe so. Flight uh, 7. You're welcome. The Danish 152, the board you're currently heading. My God. I've just realised I've been talking with my mic muted. Such an idiot. Um, <laughs> so yeah, we've got Shannon. Um, yeah, we've got Shannon here, uh, which isn't online. Then we've got Shannick Oceanic, Gander Oceanic, and then Gan uh, Gander Centre, and then pretty much all of the West uh, East Coast. So that's a lot of traffic all coming into Europe. Tango November Oscar, um, I'm clear to 
Uh, I left two to left uh, via this two fox trot. That's a lot of traffic. Look, there's all this coming over as well. We've got Winnipeg online. We've got uh, Seattle online. We've got Oakland Oceanic online. Wow. Wow, that's a lot of traffic coming over the Atlantic. Holy shit. That's going to be mental tonight. Absolutely mental. Holy shit. So that's that's what VATSIM looks like. This is what with flight the radar one looks one. like. Uh, let's get rid of the filters. Could I go off and switch one through Nar Lima passing through file three zero seven inbound market? So you see, it's not actually that different. The only difference really is the direction of the traffic. Most of the traffic this time of day comes into the US. Um, the, the North Atlantic tracks are um, specific routes because you, you don't have any radar over the, the Atlantic. So you take specific routes to specific waypoints, uh, specific GPS coordinates. And they're called North Atlantic Tracks and there's a, a bunch of them. Um, and then at night time they flip the other way. So during the day they come um, east to west. And then at night they go west to east. For the traffic coming from the states. So this is a bit of an anomaly. Um, so they might be tra taking an off-track route. Oh! Oh no. I thought we had somebody at Oslo for a minute then. Okay, so our top of descent is in half an hour. That's when we start our descent into Gardamon. Copenhagen Control, KLM two six three zero. Good afternoon. Yeah, that's KLM two six three zero. Top of descent sixteen twenty one. Current time fifteen forty nine. LM2630 parked at uh, stand 34 Bilon Airport request clearance to Copenhagen Castle as filed. LM2630 watch information hotel correct cleared to Copenhagen via Abino 6 Bravo the correction Abino 6 Alpha departure. Uh, yes, that's him. And score four, six, um, five, four. I'm actually a uh, a qualified ground controller on Vatsim um, and a student a tower controller. So the the controllers see something slightly different to this. They get this kind of view, so they'll get this view of, of their area. But there's a, a fair bit more information in there. So I did my training at Gatwick. I was a ground controller at Gatwick about 10 years ago, 12 years ago, something like that. Line 
so I'm just going to see if we can find an online controller. Oh, here we go, Hinchy's on. So, Hinchy is uh, on tower at Gatwick at the minute. Uh, no, you can't be an ATC without training. <laughs> You've got to be qualified in order to take one of the positions. Um, so this is uh, this is Hinchy. Uh, so this is what he sees. This is his strip that tells him what planes are coming in and what planes are going out. Um, and this is an overlay for our benefit of arrivals and departures. So yeah, he's a Gatwick Tower controller. He's a big boy. Got his big boy pants on. But they also have a radar view. So the radar controllers have a a, a radar view, which is very cool. And so do the ground controllers actually, so you can see exactly where people are on the runway, uh, on the taxiways. <laughs> yes, it, all of the above. Um, it's a game, but it's it, it's a simulator at the end of the day. And so we simulate ATC as well as the pilots, the, the, the actual flights themselves. It's all very tightly governed, it's all very well organised. And then events like this weekend, the Cross the Pond event, all of that traffic coming over to the UK. So there's going to be uh, the London controllers, the London regional controllers like I was talking to before then there will be the tower controllers and then there will be the ground controllers uh, oh there will be approach controllers as well so you hand off to hand off the planes to each along the way no people train me um, I, I got to, I can't remember the guys who taught me now but it was many years ago so um, but yeah, it, it's people, and then you have an exam, and if you pass the exam, you get the uh, the grade in. I'm a, an S1, which is a student level one, which is a tower student essentially. Yeah, so it's uh, the VATSIM UK that I'm a member of. Um, that goes off the CAA. Uh, it's a copy, essentially, of the CAA um, regulations and processes. And the, the RT manual, CAP 435, I think it is. Taxi holding point 27 by November in Kilo, KLM which is the radio telephony procedures CIA
Hello. Oh, 413. It's the same one I had to learn when I was doing my pilot training. My actual pilot training, IRL pilot training, not virtual pilot training. descending <laughs> 200. That's the other cool thing as well, actually. If I find my flight and select me, you get to see my my details here. So you'll see after my name and my home airport, it says PPL. Because I've got a private pilot's license for real, um, they give me a PPL rating in VATSIM. Because they, they do offer pilot training as well, although you don't need it to fly. Um, so, yeah, because I've got a PPL, they give me the PPL rating. It is quite cool. And now you know my real name. Bob. <laughs> Forgotten. Do you have a? Did you have a license? Oh. Okay. <laughs> I thought I was talking to another pilot buddy for a minute then. Copenhagen control for day, Ryanair 838, flight level 390. Ah, I think I remember us having this conversation before. I think I remember you telling me this before, yeah. I'm 50 now. My my memory's awful. Let's see how to say thank you in Danish. Tax skal du have. Tax skal du have. Tax skal du have. Tax skal du have. I'm not even going to attempt that because I'll just make an absolute ass of myself, won't I? <laughs> yes, I think you did. Okay, so our top of descent is in 160 nautical miles. Okay, 
Okay, so everything's still normal, which is good. No company messages, which is also good. So let's brief our approach. The arrival. Oh, let's go for the start. So the arrival, Ripper 3 Lima. So we arrive. Maximum 250 knots at Ripham. And Ripham is, I think, the one, one or two after landing. Yeah. Oh, it's the third one after landing. So we've got our constraints in there, 250 knots. Flight level 110 by 407. Flight level 100. Okay, so... Those constraints are in, they're magenta as well, so computer thinks it's going to make it. And then 5,000 or above at Valpo. 5,000 or above at Valpo will be at 5597. Okay. So the approach then, are the yeah, the approach. 3,500 feet, so... Speed 250 knots for less. Speed 250 knots for less for Lufthansa success. Valpu, 220 knots, 5,000 feet. 4,000 feet before Ogras. And 3,500 before Zikla. Uh, make sure all those are in. Yeah. Descending flight level eight zero for the Lufthansa success. Yeah. Then we've got our decel point, which is the start of our approach. And we've got Zickler at three thousand five hundred. Three zero identify flight level three three climb now flight level one two zero. And that's 706 feet altitude, which is the height of Gardamon. <gasps> oh, oh my days! Look at that out there. How pretty is that? Oh no, let's let's get a better view than that, shall we? See, this is why I love flight sim, because it's you d d d every now and then you just get struck with that. Ooh, pretty! Just look at the colour of those clouds. Turn right heading zero three five. Los Santos success. Copenhagen, go. Copenhagen, go. Copenhagen, go. Copenhagen, go. Copenhagen, go. Copenhagen, go. So, what altitude are we going to put in? We're going to put in 3,500. So go all the way down. To 3,000. Or 4,000. And we'll flick that switch. And put 3,500 in the box. Okay. 
So that's ready. We've got no decision height because we're doing a Cat 3 dual, a Cat 3 Bravo landing. So help me God. Uh, Top of descent, 1621 in 15 minutes. Okay. So, perfect time. Because the, uh, the seatbelt lights will be coming on soon. Once we get down to 10,000 feet. But, of course... My seatbelt signs will be coming on as we start the descent in 15 minutes. So, I'm going to go to the little boy's room. Hi Nick, so clear Monarch to Fox Trot arrival expecting runway to two left for Lufthansa 66. Lufthansa 66, thank you. Contact Copenhagen approach, frequency 119 at decimal 8. Goodbye. Contacting approach on 109 right. Thank you much for service. Have a nice evening. Bye bye, Lufthansa 66. Uh, Speedbird 760, permission to leave the flight deck for two minutes. Speedbird 760, you can change to Unicom, frequency 122 decimal 8, goodbye. Unicom 122 decimal 8, thank you, bye bye. Okay, so now I'm on Unicom. Oh, yeah. <laughs> semi professional. <laughs> oh my god. Now I'm on oh uh, Unicom. I can. Uh, Go and take a comfort break before we descend. After that, <laughs> exactly that, Stow. Exactly that. Back in a minute. My God. And I'm back. Look at that. Oh my days, how pretty is that?
Oh. 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 I think I've just done a thing. Oh. Thank you, Snow. Oh, that's beautiful. See? It's just so pretty. How can you not want to, to, to fly this this simulator? So pretty. Okay, 70 something miles to top of descent now. About nine minutes. So pretty. Okay, so on my arrival page. When we get when we get to Ripon we'll see a little arrow on here telling me where I am on the arrival route. So above flight level one two zero at Roxim, I think that was our first constraint but the so I put 3500 in there and then when I click the button it'll start to descend but it'll stop at the first constraint so it won't go lower than I'm allowed to go because the computer knows all the computer is all intelligent all powerful and all knowing Transition altitude. What's the transition altitude? Da, 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 da. Reaching. No, so it'll be on the approach. Transition altitude. Where are you? Transition altitude. Seven thousand. Performance. Descent. Transition altitude 7000, perfect. Mist approach is 5000 feet. So once we're down at our 3500 we'll, and we're on the glide slope, I'll put 5000 in the autopilot so that if we have to go around, we uh, we punch it, we give it the full beans and climb up to 5,000 Oh good, I am glad When we land as well I'll, I'll check out that actual BA 760 flight. In fact, it should be on flight radar. Oh, they're actually closer than we are. Look, there it is. And we're not there. We're here. So he's gone faster. 
Oh, I'm a little disappointed now. That's not the one. That's the one. Yeah, that's the real Speedbird 760. He's in his descent already. Oh well. I'll get. Oh, just. Oh, it's gone from orange to pink. Oh, look at that. Oh my life. That is so pretty. The stars are real too, by the way. I mean, obviously not real, real, but they're in the right positions. Oh. Look at that. How, how gorgeous is that? <sighs> I'm getting carried away here and I will miss my top of descent if I'm not careful. It's just totes adorbs. No, I don't believe they have meteor showers. No. I've not seen any at least. Although I've heard that the, the, the Northern Lights is a thing in the game. Although I've never actually seen it. Okay, so 20 miles from top of descent, 6 miles from Vavit. We've got any traffic around us? Flip that over to Nav and put the range up. We don't seem to have any traffic within 160 miles, which is nice. Let's uh, tilt uh, all. There we go. Although I don't actually think it does tilt down as well as up. But there doesn't seem to be anything within 80 miles or even 160. So that'll do. Oh, I've just realised I've left that on the screen. Let me get rid of that. There we go. Oh, so pretty. From orange to pink to purple. Th they might do. Um, I, I haven't seen them myself. I, I'm not saying I can't say that they're not there. I haven't seen them. But yeah, I agree. It, that would be nice. The Orionids and the Perseids and what have you. That yeah, that'd be really cool. Okay, uh, let's get myself seated properly. Get my view realigned. 
and let everybody know what I'm doing. Oslo traffic speedboat 760 departing flight level 350 uh, for a Ripham 3 Lima approach to Oslo Gardermoen runway 01 left. Oslo traffic. And there we go, top of descent, let's start. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the captain. You may have noticed we've just started our descent into Oslo. Our expected time is uh, 16.48 Zulu, so that will be 18, 10 to 7 in the evening. The weather is 5 degrees and a little bit cloudy, not too much. Uh, there's no rain. We're expecting some freezing fog later, so for your onward journey, please wrap up when it's warm. We'll be passing through 10,000 feet soon, at which point I'll be turning the no smoking signs and the seatbelt signs back on. Please ensure you're back in your seat with your tray table stowed and your seat back in the upright position. Thank you. Never actually done one of those before. Uh, <laughs> I wish, though. I wish. That's the only problem with flying on Vatsim. You can't really nip out for a quick smoke. And it's, it, it's equally as bad when you're streaming as well, because it's not really the dumb thing to nip out for a smoke, because I, I don't smoke in the house, you see. The good old bad days, indeed. Yeah, I don't smoke in the house because of the kids. So, I say kids. They're 23 and 18 now, but still. <laughs> okay, passing 29,000 feet. getting dark so let's switch to night charts instead see I mentioned before about the plane won't let us go lower than uh, we're allowed to I put three and a half thousand in there and it's saying flight level 110 that's our first stopping point now chances are we'll be around about that when we get there and so it'll actually be a continual descent down to 3500 but just in case it will halt our descent at flight level 110 is that somebody trying to get me on their channel? no it's not oh that, that Wizz Air 01 is on final approach at Oslo he's the guy that was ahead of us so uh, we're expected 1648 uh, so that's 25 minutes there or thereabouts see what I mean about seeing the city lights uh, no no death death drop would be a bad thing TM Yeah, you can see the road around the lake there. See the, the towns and the cities below me. <laughs> I'm surprised your dad didn't teach you that one already, TBH. Fairly basic. I think that's one of the first things they teach you. A death drop is a bad thing, TM. It's lesson two after fire in a plane is a bad thing, TM.
Okay, so about 40 miles away from the turn. GM410, which is where we turn, that's our first constraint at flight level 110. Okay, we've got our speed constraint coming in now of 250 because we're not allowed to go above 250 under 10,000 feet. Oh, I keep on forgetting. And in fact, you know what? I'm not going to go for a an auto land. I'm I'm going to No, 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 I'm not. No, I'm not. I'm I'm going to go for a manual landing. So, let's get back this chart. Let's see what the decision height was or decision altitude. Decision altitude 765 for a cat 2. More drag. Clear the radio and seven six two for the barrow. So I think I need more drag, so I'll drop out my. Oh, actually, let's uh, let's get some lights going on in this place. I'll drop my speed brake out. See, that's... We're going to miss that constraint, I think, at 110 if we don't get this speed down, so... Uh, altitude, rather. 765, you did remember! Okay, so Wizard is off the runway at Oslo. my steep speed brake and we're going to need to arm that later so put my dome light on so I can see a little bit better that'll need to come off when I'm on the approach Probably on the approach around about Valpu. Um, I yeah, there's not much time after that, so I'll arm it about Valpu. That'll help to make sure we can get our speed and what have you down. I'm going to put that speed brake out again, you know. What's our rate of descent doing there? 17 with it extended. Uh, 
18 with it retracted. Ah, we'll leave it as it is then. It's coming up 16. Yeah, because it's saying we're going to reach our bottom of descent there. Oh no, it's not. That's our. That's where we can descend further. To our next descent point otherwise the arrow would be pointing to the dot and it's not pointing away from the dot cool 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 so we're on target yeah there you go you see the arrow pointing to it is at the waypoint so we're golden and there's flight level 110 <laughs> they're, they're super realistic that's all provided by this plane um, th this this is an add-on for Flight Simulator. This isn't one of the stock planes. And they've really gone to town on all of the little... Uh, the engine noises, the little whistles, the clicks, um, the hydraulic pumps. Everything is so real, it's brilliant. Yeah, the engine's spooling up again so we can keep 11,000 11, feet. Yeah, the EFB, the electronic flight bag, is fantastic. It, it, it's kind of realistic, but each airline has their own, their own version. So you know, it's okay. So that was our first. Uh, So that's where we are now. So we've got to maintain flight level 110 all the way around here and then descend to be at or above 5,000 feet there. All the while doing no more than 220 knots. Which is fine, we're doing 200, that's just dandy. Still no aircraft around us, so that's good. I'm going to turn this one into the landing system, I think. Okay, so approach checklists. Approach ECAM status. Checked. Status normal. Recall normal. ECAM status checked. Approach type and runway. We're doing ILS to zero 01 left. ILS zero 01 left. Uh, minima is 765 because Stowe remembered 
we have an approach phase. We won't activate the approach phase yet until we get uh, past Valpu. What I will do is get that ready. And once we pass 7,000 feet, we'll change to the Barrow Ref. Let's just check the... Uh, oh. Check the ATC for Oslo, or the um, Metar for the arrival. Uh, QNH 1010, so it's the same as when we left. That's nice and easy. Uh, 0503. So we'll put that into the Perth page as well. 050 at 3 knots. And the temperature is still 5 degrees. And it's 1010 on the QNH. One zero one zero QNH. Cool, 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 cool. Okay. So now our landing lights can come on. Our seatbelt signs can go on. No point in dropping the uh, taxi or turn-off lights on yet, because the gear isn't down. And they're attached to the front gear, so... Okay, so... Landing checklist. Speed brake medium. Missed approach altitude. Out. In fact, I, I won't set that until we're actually on the glide slope, because otherwise it will uh, it will cancel that out and it will take us back up to five thousand, which is not what we want. So we're approaching Valpu now. If I flip that back up to Nav Arc. So it's up to 40. Yeah, we're less than 20 miles away from the end of the runway, so. Okay, so let's get the. Oh, the approach phase activated. Confirm. Okay. We'll stay at 200 knots for now. So we get past Valpu. And we'll get the first stage of flapping. Cabin crew, 10 minutes to land. We'll give them a little ping with that as well, although it doesn't actually work. 
Um, okay, so speed check, flaps one, change to normal operating pressure, uh, barometric pressure rather, and the emergency to 1010. See the uh, the airport out on our left hand side there. Valpoop. Okay, so we get the speed brakes armed. Turn the landing systems on so we can see our oh, and switch that over to the landing system display for the MFD or the ND rather. Okay, so there's the glide slope. It's going to disappear off to the top, but that's fine because it will come down again. We've got our ILS frequency tuned and ready so I'll turn on the localizer descent alt blue nav lock blue so we're at our constraint of 35 or reaching our constraint of 3500 by Zickler is our final approach fix. Approach phase, clear to an altitude, barrow ref set, approach checklist complete, auto brake all, uh, armed, missed approach altitude we'll set in a moment, ECAM memo we'll check when we get the gear down. Okay. Speed check, flops two. Gear down. Alt star. Localizer captured. Two thousand five hundred. Speed check. Flaps three. And flaps four. Oh shit, we're well over the glide path. I definitely did not uh, uh, intercept that glide path very well at all. Let's turn the autopilot off. Disconnect the autopilot. Let's get right down because we are going to fly right over this if we're not careful. should be on that purple s diamond that's coming up on the this this should be here 
I didn't arm the approach phase which didn't lock onto the glide slope. Glide slope start, okay. Glide slope captured. Phew! Localizer captured. Cat 3 dual. We've got a barrow ref in, so we're not going to do an auto land. But it protects us in case we have an autopilot failure. I'm going to put this back up to 5000, which is our missed approach altitude. Get the dome light off, because we're not allowed to have those in Europe on a landing. Okay. And he can checked landing no blue. Landing checklist complete. One thousand. Oslo traffic. Scandinavian four six zero eight is on the ILS zero one left uh, ten miles out. Oslo oh. Oslo traffic, uh, Speedbird 760 is on a two mile final for zero one left, Oslo traffic. Okay, disconnect the autopilot. Fly down manually. Land enabled. Hundred above. Continue. No, that's actually really, really bad. Pull up. 30, 20, retard. Oh, retard. that was a heavy ass landing. Auto brake, reverse screen, D cell. 60 knots, 40 knots, manual brake. Taxi lights on. Because there's our taxiway. I think we probably could have taken the next one actually. Okay, let's clean her up. Flaps up. Disarm speed brakes. Speed to speedbird seven six zero Oslo traffic clear of zero one left Oslo traffic. And there's the other one that was coming in behind us. Uh, that, I think that was probably my worst landing in quite some time. That was terrible. Let's turn that off, turn that off. Turn that off. So we are going via Mike Kilo Kilo 1 Gate 9. Gate. Where's gate nine? Gate nine. Oh. No. No, 
that's the GA apron. Oh well, I guess we'll just have to find it manually and tell GSX when we get there. Oslo traffic speedbird 760, uh, taxiing on Mike Kilo, Kilo 1 to gate 9, Oslo traffic. Thank you Stowe, thank you for coming. I very much appreciate it. And uh, yeah, I'll, uh, I'll I'll probably be streaming again tomorrow daytime. We shall see. So, after landing checklist. Exterior lights set. Well, let's turn our... Dome light on. Turn our taxi lights on. And our runway turn off lights on. Our strobes go back to auto. That'll do for now. Now we can actually see the taxiway. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. Flaps at zero, ground spot is disarmed. APU, of course, I need the APU on. And start. Which taxiway is that? Still mic. I missed a taxiway somewhere through not paying attention. Yes, yes, I have. Uh, Speedbird 760 entirely missed Kilo and Kilo 1. I'll come back up November for Kilo, Kilo 1, Oslo traffic. Okay, so da, 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 da. back to the checklist. Weather radar off, TCAS off, and we haven't got engine to shut down. Okay. So it's just a case of watching where I'm going now then. November 5, November 3. And then Kilo. So while we're at it, we'll turn the flight directors and landing systems off because we don't need them anymore. Uh, got the lights still on, that's fine. Okay.
So that's Alpha 3. Uh, November 4. There it is. That's our parking right there. There we are, on Kilo. Cool, cool, cool. Oh uh, well, we've picked stand 11, that'll do us. There we go. And cut engines, pack and brakes on. Let's get the packs on to keep the engine, uh, the cabin nice and warm while they get off. And cut engine two, cut engine one. We are golden. Thank you, sir. Is he actually going to give me a rating? Oh, here comes the uh, the gate. In fact, that's the Phoenix Sim doing that. So let's tell it not to do that because GSX is going to do that in a minute. Okay, GSX. Let's get our seatbelt signs off. Let's turn our taxi lights off because it's probably blind in that poor bugger. Let's get our GPU attached and we will request deboarding. And we'll use Norwegian Air Shuttle, why not? Yeah, and, and exactly, yeah, this is where everybody stands up and starts rubbaging in the overhead lockers okay in fact let's get the preconditioned air in as well why why are you all the way over there is that a really badly aligned it is, isn't it? It's a really... Uh, so we're going to see passengers walking in mid-air in a minute. Passengers deporting starting. You watch, here they go. Here they go. The magical passengers walking in mid-air. Because... GSX doesn't know... In, in fact, it's, it's, actu I've, it's actually parked me in the right place. 
but this isn't coming out far enough so they have to walk in midair I exactly that yeah it's the n it's the the northern lights effect that's what it is are they actually on the wrong side of the they are as well look at that that th thank you gsx thank you for your perfect what a piece of horseshit seriously <laughs> So GSX is another uh, add-on I've got, um, and it does all of the the catering trucks and the, the the baggage handling and all of that stuff, um, and it also does the passengers, and you can see it doesn't do them very well. Two, three passengers. I'm pretty sure. There's more than four passengers there, GSX. I'm, I'm just going to go out on a limb and say there's considerably more than seven. Oh well. So... Marshall's still there as well, saying something to me. I don't know what he's saying. But there we go. Uh, company message. That'll be our arrival message, no doubt. Let me see. Uh, receive messages, arrival message. And our arrival time. We actually should have turned that off as well. 2 hours 23, so it was about 2 hours 15 ish, 18. Gate to gate. Which is not bad. Look, they've all gone, GSX. They've all gone. There are no more passengers to deboard. Now you're just taking the piss. Well, thank you very much for being a fantastic passenger. Sufficiently agitated. I'm glad you enjoyed it. Please fly Glenelg Air again. <laughs> that's, that's what it is. It's the ghosts. Uh, no, because they're staying for a turnaround. So just the baggage to unload now. And that's the last one for you. And the last one for you. And then you can bugger off and then I can bugger off. Okay, so let's start turning all the electrics off. Uh, da, 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 they're all off. We can. Everybody's out now, so we can turn off the emergency signs. We can turn off the ideas. Three. No, no. Three, two, one. There you go. Yes, I know. I know. I've turned it off. I'm going to be turning you off in a minute. Shut up. Uh, pumps off. And... Crew oxygen off. go are they uh, are they done with my baggage yet D 
happy board and completed. Fantastico. Yep, there they go. Driving off into the sunset. Awesome. Well, that is where this flight ends. Actually, what I should probably do. Let me jump back into the... Yes, I do, don't I? I need to turn that off. Turn that off. And turn my batteries off. So it is once again cold and dark. You too, buddy. Thanks for turning up. Thanks for coming. Thanks for, for sticking around. I hope you have a great evening. Um, I wonder if... Uh, Alex is streaming yet. I know he said he was gonna. Uh, no. Uh, oh, was it Adam? I think it might have been Adam that's streaming tonight, isn't it? Where's my browser gone? There's my browser. Uh, is Adam on? No, Adam's not on. Oh, follow the greens is on. Oh, there you go. Heathrow Tower controller. Now there's a Heathrow Tower. <laughs> so, I'm going to go raid. Um, follow the greens. Uh... Da -da. I'll see you soon, buddy. You take care. Gosh. Oh, dearie me. I mean, Wizz Air's not too bad, though, apparently. I've never flown on Wizz Air. I've flown on EasyJet and Ryanair. And I can imagine they're very much like EasyJet, to be fair. But I've never flown on them. Five hours is a long time. Especially with annoying flight into and no leg room. Just make sure you download a film on your iPad. Watch Dharma. If you like that kind of thing on Netflix, Dharma, that's a good, that, that's, that was good. It's pretty morbid, like, but... Who's this guy? Oh! Who's that? Glennog! <laughs> Thank you for your host! I appreciate it. Very kind of you. Speed bed, T775, Fort Worth, Charlie. Speed bed, T777, visual approach, 27 right. Easy 10727 low, 27 right, clear to land, wind 160 degrees, 7 knots. Wind copy, clear to land, wind 27 right, easy 1027. Clear to land, 7625 at holding point, Senior Bravo.